Sir Robin Knox Johnson sailed back up the Solent today after completing his second solo circumnavigation, 38 years after he became the first person to sail non-stop around the world in the Sunday Times Golden Globe race in 1969. His Open 60 Saga Insurance was accompanied up a rough and windy Solent by yachts from his company's Clipper Round the World Race fleet and two Royal Navy patrol boats. A much larger welcome flotilla would have greeted him, but a force seven and rough seas deterred all but the most determined. Sir Robin came fourth in the Velux Five Oceans race when he finished in Bilbao, Spain, eight days ago. Of the seven starters, Alex Thompson and Mike Golding were both forced to withdraw in dramatic circumstances, and Graham Dalton had to retire at the end of the penultimate leg. But while others fell by the wayside, 68-year-old Sir Robin overcame equipment failure and running out of whisky to knock 153 days off his 1969 time of 312 days at sea. In 1969, Knox Johnson sailed his 32-foot wooden catch Sue Haley into the record books. This time, he has sailed a high-tech Open 60 around the world in 159 days. In 1969, he had no modern instruments and communication systems. This time, he was plagued with equipment failures and bemoaned the problems he found with his high-tech equipment. As Saga Insurance passed cows, Sir Robin was honoured by a seven-gun salute from a cannon at the Royal Yacht Squadron and three cheers from the members gathered on the castle battlements. Then it was on to Portsmouth for a triumphant return and a welcome from his daughter and five grandchildren, along with family, friends and hundreds of supporters.